to recover an antizen drop. Good, Crane. This offers us a new strategy. Time to turn your attention to Rise. Listen closely. It's very possible that Rise is our man. So if you find an airdrop containing antizen, destroy it. What? What? Why? It will force interaction with Rise. You can go under Brecken's auspices as an ambassador, if you will. But, but there are civilians depending on this stuff. Our plan is focused on the greater good. Remember that. Jade, I'm at the airdrop. There's no answers in here.
ಎಲ್ಲ What do you get from a zombie during the winter? I made it in one piece. Now I know how Brecken must have felt running at night. It is no picnic. Got to report to him and tell him I don't have any antis in. Lying to everyone stinks, but I know the GRE is working for the greater good. Come on. I mean, we need Anderson. I know, but buying from Rise? You can't be oh, serious. For God's sakes, I'll go. I'm not scared. Absolutely not. We've discussed that already. But we didn't discuss it. You just decided that I'll I... go. Are you serious? Well, this Rice guy has never seen my face before. Clean slate, right? Could you guys give Crane and me the room, please? You sure you're up for this? Has to be done, doesn't it? Well, I'm not going to argue. Race's place is over here. Just find out what this will cost us and come back in one piece. Brecken is so desperate he's ready to deal with the devil himself, Rise. And since I'm supposed to determine whether or not Rice is the one who stole the GRE's secret document, well, this is the perfect opportunity. You know, Alfie, right? He's our handyman. Sit in the workshop. You want Anderson? Forget about the drops and talk with Rice. You're Alfie? That's me. Electricity. Building maintenance. I keep this place running somehow. Glad you're here. I was just about to call you. What's the problem? Well, it's good news, bad news. The good news is that you restore the lights in the Cauldron District. The bad news is that it blew out the grid near the overpass. It's blacker than your pants pocket over there. So, do you need it switched back on? There are two substations. Flick, flick, you switch them on. The order doesn't matter. Then you throw the master in the main station, and it'll light up like a Christmas tree. I think I can do it. Of course you can do it. Any runner could do it. But there's a catch. Shutting off the lights has created a little black patch for the volatiles. Bunches of them are gathering there after sundown. So I've rigged a trap. It's already in place, all set to go. Now, if you can get in there and restore the power after it's dark, we can fry a whole lot of freaks in one shot. After dark? That's... that's gonna be a lot dicier. Sure. That's why no one's volunteered for this job. But I'm thinking maybe you're a bit tougher than the rest of these guys. Just an impression. Let's just say I'm here to help. Really? 
Good intentions, huh? Hope you've got some guts, or you won't last long. Another night to survive. Crane, can you hear me? Jade? Yeah, I copy. Something wrong? No, no, it's... Um... Listen, Crane, we all appreciate what you're doing. And I know you're doing it to redeem yourself. Because Amir died saving your life. Look, I'm doing it because if we don't get Antis in from Rice, people will start to die. You know, I met Amir right after the outbreak. I didn't know him for that long, but... He was the best, most decent man I've ever known. But I just want you to know that I don't blame you. Amir knew the risk. And Crane, we know that you too are taking a risk to do this for us. I... Look, Jade, we'll talk when I get back with the Antizen, okay? Okay. Just... Just come back in one piece, alright? Go ahead. We found two more vials of that fake antazine. Reckon it's boiling mad. Yeah, I'll bet. How's Bahir? He's stable. But if we'd gotten to him ten minutes later, he wouldn't be. This stuff is lethal, Crane. Putting them out of business is your number one priority. I'd right, understood. Okay, Raheem, I'm here. Make sure they see you and know who you are. You don't want to sneak up on them. That's a good way to catch a bullet. 
Wish me luck, kid. Good luck, brother. You're going to need it. Don't shoot! Don't shoot! Hands up! What the fuck do you want? I'm here to see Rice. Brecken sent me. Brecken? That asshole on the tower? Alright, what does he want? I've come to make a deal. <laughs> what kind of deal? The kind I make with Rice, not with his flunkies. Alright, let him through. This ought to be entertaining. How long have we been friends, Osman? We have been friends for a very long time. That is why I'm so surprised that you would steal from me! Haven't I seen you somewhere before? Now I'll give you a choice. Very simple. Your right hand or your left. Left! Oh. Was that my left or your left? You have the look of the tower about you. What do you want? I'm here to make a deal. A deal. For fantasy, no doubt. Desperate times. And what do you offer in return? Hmm? Your services? Your loyalty? Perhaps I should take both. Talk to Karim. He's one of ours. Do what he asks of you, and Rise will consider giving your people some fantasy. Understood? Don't seem to have a choice. Perceptive. I met Rice, and Jade's right, he's a psychopath. He's also the GRE's rogue operative. Now I've got to cooperate with this piece of shit. Not only because of my mission, but also because he's got a ton of antizen stockpiled. There you are. Rice said you'd be coming by. I'm Karim. Crane. An American. I have an uncle there. Lives in Texas. You from Texas? You a cowboy? I'm from Chicago. Okay, Al Capone. We'll be in constant contact over the radio. That way I can make sure you get where you need to go. And where's that exactly? You're going to be climbing antenna towers and switching on shortwave radio modulators. Most of my men are too slow, too fat, or too drunk to climb a tower like that without killing themselves. If I do this, I'll get the answers in? That's between you and Rice. I know better than to speak for him. Just don't fail. He doesn't handle disappointment very well.
Here we go. Just met a guy named Kareem. He's like Rice's major domo, I guess. Or number one flunky at the very least. Kareem sending me to fix some antennas for Rice. Nothing better than being an errand boy. Just met Rise. There's no question, that's Suleiman. Guy's a psychopath. He's gone from ruthless politician to fucking warlord. Is he aware of your affiliation with us? No. He thinks I'm just a guy from the tower. In fact, he's making me jump through hoops before he'll give me any antizen. Acknowledged. Continue to do as he asks. Remember, we need that file. Great. Crane out. <laughs> 